Hi, this is Andrew Burwald, and I'm a certified application engineer with Go Engineer. SolidWorks 2015 offers a lot of enhancements for the surface modeling side of the software. Now using our sketcher, we can convert traditional splines to style splines and vice versa. Once the spline is converted, we can choose the degree of that style spline and control its shape by dragging the points. We can also use that sketch to split up our surface body. Previously, the split feature was only usable on solid parts. Now in 2015, we can split up our surfaces into logical components. The spline on surface command inside of SOLIDWORKS 2015 has also been improved greatly. It can now span multiple surfaces and is much more accurate than it was previously. We can add some relations to define our shape. And we can then use that sketch to trim our surface body. Oftentimes, we will want to flatten a surface to see what it would look like in its flattened state. New in SOLIDWORKS 2015, we can flatten out our surfaces to get a flat pattern for a curved model. We can use control curves to refine the shape. And once the surface is flattened, we can enable a deformation plot to see where the material may need to stretch or compress. Lastly, we can export that flattened pattern of the surface to a DXF or a DWG. Thank you for watching. This has been Andrew Burwald with Go Engineer.